The iPhone 5S has a fingerprint sensor right in the home button. How does it work? I have no idea. Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from Pocket Now, and in this video we're going to go through Touch ID for the very first time and show you how it works on the iPhone 5S. Let's get to it. Now I am not one to use a password on my phone, but I know that a lot of you do and it can really slow you down when you're trying to access your phone. It's great for security, but terrible for convenience. So having a uh, fingerprint sensor right in the home button really can save you a lot of time. Also, it's maddening to constantly have to type your iTunes password when you're downloading apps because iTunes requires you to have a pretty complex password with some numbers and a capital letter, so that can slow you down too. With Touch ID, hopefully that will be a thing of the past. So the way it works is as follows. We're going to go over into general in the settings, and then we're going to go down to passcode and fingerprint. And I'm kind of going through this for, this, for the first time with you. Uh, so I'm gonna turn passcode on. So you need a standard passcode in order for the fingerprint mechanism to work. Now that that works, I'm gonna go down to fingerprints. Add a fingerprint. So your wife, your, your, your brother, or whatever, anyone else that you wanna have access to the phone, you can add multiple fingerprints. Set up fingerprints. Scan the finger or thumb you normally use on the home button. All right, what do you mean by scan? Place your finger, lift and rest your finger on the home button repeatedly. That's fun. It's really fun, actually. It's probably the most fun thing ever. Adjust your grip. Keep going to capture the edges of your print. Okay. I hope this isn't my actual fingerprint because that would be pretty bad for, uh, you know, security. No, I think this is just a standard image. Success, touch ID is ready. That was pretty easy. You can, your print can be used for unlocking your phone. All right, prove it, continue. Okay, so here is passcode unlock turned on for the home screen and iTunes and App Store. And there's that annoying thing again, you gotta put in your password. Now let's see how it works. The phone is off. I was hoping you could just take your thumb and press it up against the touch sensor and have it work, but you actually have to press it in first and then tap and hold, and then you're in. Works very, very quickly. That is really impressive. Now do that again. I really didn't have to position my finger in any kind of uh, orientation. So if I tap it again, tap and hold, boom, we're in. That's really, really fast and really nice. Uh, so hopefully they make this available to third-party developers so that all passwords throughout your system are linked to your fingerprint so you don't have to type passwords again. That would be super awesome. So that was a quick look at Touch ID. Uh, if you have any questions about how it works, drop us a comment and let us know. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.